Hello, and thank you for coming to the Cougar Ambassador Training for Cougs Give. I'm Shelley Newhart, the Generational Giving Program Manager here at WSU at the Foundation, and thank you so much for attending. This is going to be the same information that we've provided in the live webinars, just in a condensed recorded version. So again, thank you, and we hope that you walk away with some really great information about how to be a Cougar Ambassador. So what is Cougs Give? It is a one-day event celebrating the dedication of WSU's many generous donors like yourselves. And so on April 10th, Cougs are gonna come together to give in support of student success. We're gonna share our Coug memories and our stories and celebrate the impact of donor support and how it's really changed the WSU experience for students for the better. So what is an ambassador? It's somebody who represents, advocates, and outwardly supports a cause or an activity. That's a little definition that we've thrown together. And we've also created a definition for Cougar ambassadors, which is really a jazzed up version of an ambassador definition. And that's somebody who has Cougar pride, advocates for student success, and outwardly supports Cougs Give. And by signing up to be a Cougar Ambassador, you've really already done those things. You've proven that you have that pride. You've already ad started advocating for student success and supporting Cougs Give. But we're going to show you a couple more strategic ways to do that uh, leading up to the day and then on April 10th. And why are Cougar Ambassadors important? I wanted to give you a little bit of data just to show what people are thinking about when they hear from different philanthropic groups. So this is a graph that shows generational opinions about philanthropic communications. And across the board, across all generations, people really want to hear from friends and family members, which is why things like giving days and crowdfunding have really changed the way that we see philanthropy. And if you think about even yourself, if you've gotten a letter in the mail from a philanthropic organization or an email or a social network message, you may have seen that message. But if a friend or a family member came to you today and, say, and said, you know, we are supporting Kooks Give, here's why we're supporting, will you make a gift? You might be more likely to actually make that gift than if you just received a generic email from somebody that you don't know. So that's why Cougar Ambassadors are really critical on days like this. I also wanted to highlight just how much Cougar ambassadors have shaped Cougs Give and the way that they've changed the way we do a giving day. In 2016, we didn't really have ambassadors inspiring giving, and it wasn't because we don't have proud Cougs. It was because we didn't have the, the sauce, the formula, the right way to communicate with everyone, everyone on what it really means to be a Cougar ambassador. So we've changed that a little bit throughout the years. And by that, we've seen a 7% increase alone in one year. And we've updated our webinar trainings and we've created toolkits and we have a better way of communicating the importance of Cougar ambassadorship to our Cougs. And that's really what has led to a huge increase to 20% of our total amount raised being inspired by ambassadors over 2016. So just to see Cougs inspiring other Cougs to give is really the important part of this day and we couldn't do it without you. As a Cougar ambassador, here's the key things that we really want to see and what we hope uh, you can accomplish on a day like this. We want you to share those Coug memories. Why is it important to be a Coug? What does it mean to be a Coug? Why do we support the students at WSU? I think those are all really easy things to answer. Uh, put that into a social media post, put that into a text message, send it out to your other Coug friends and let them know why you should be supporting Coug's Give. And to tie right into that, we want you to recruit fellow cheerleaders. Who are those Cougs that are showing up to events, that are making a difference in students' lives, that are already giving, or maybe they're new to giving to WSU? How can you really show them 
why Coop's Give is an important day for philanthropy at WSU. And then at the end of the day, we really want to see you support students by making a gift. Every gift counts on Coog's Give. Wherever you want to give, no matter the size of the gift, it's all important and it really will change students' lives. Where can you be a Cougar Ambassador? This is a question we also receive quite a bit, and I'll show you how you can utilize some of these tools a little bit later in the session, but I just wanna give you an idea of the different places where you can really engage other Cougs. I think one that's maybe a little bit more obvious is social sharing apps, because this is a digital heavy day you're gonna be able to actually directly link to your Twitter, Facebook, and LinkedIn account through your ambassador dashboard. You can also send a direct email from your dashboard, or you can copy a link and send it out in the email platform that you prefer. And don't forget about phone calls or text. There's gonna be a really easy way for you to copy and paste a link, send it in a text message, or also if you're having a phone conversation with somebody, it's pretty simple to hopefully tag on, we hope you engage with Coogs Give, and the best way to do that is by going to coogsgive.wsu.edu, signing up to be an ambassador, and making a gift on April 10th. And don't forget about those critical conversations you can have with fellow Coogs. A lot of us work in industries where there are a lot of Cougs already working at the same place, or you have a network of friends that are full of Cougs. Don't be afraid to reach out to those people, have those conversations in person or digitally, and talk to them about what it means to be uh, involved on Cougs Give. And the moral of the story is really wherever it works for you. The Cougar Ambassador experience may look different for everyone, and that's okay. We all have different peer groups. We all have different forms of communication that we prefer. Do what works for you, and hopefully we have provided the right tools and resources to allow you to do that and also keep track of the people that you're inspiring. So I've talked about the where, the what, the why, but really it's about the how. That's what this training is gonna focus on. How can I be an effective Cougar ambassador? And for starters, I wanna talk about our website, the Cougs Give platform. And you'll hear me refer to it as a platform or a website. It's really interchangeable for us for this day. And so you're gonna see this main page every time you log in uh, or access cougsgive.wsu.edu. And from there, the possibilities are hopefully endless for you and your ambassador experience. You should have received a welcome email from us through the Cougs Give website. If you received that email but haven't heard from us in a while, chances are we could have ended up in the spam folder. So please continue to check that spam folder if you haven't heard from us. We may have made our way in there. Please mark us as a safe sender so that you can get all of that great up-to-date information. All of this information is going to be coming from our Cougar Ambassador Guide this year. We have a great student employee at the foundation named Katie Kendrick, and she will be sending these emails through the platform. We wanted to really just give a name and a face to the Cougar Ambassador experience this year, and so we've asked Katie to help us with that. So yes, she is a real student here at WSU Pullman, and uh, we really hope that you enjoy the, the communications that she's gonna be sending out to you. So this is the dashboard that I've talked about, and hopefully you've maybe at least seen it once or twice if you've already logged in and signed up to be an ambassador, but I wanna just show you a few key things that you'll need to know about the dashboard. One, I want you to really make sure that it is hashtag Cougs Give and it's the right date. We have some really great ambassadors that have been with us for a couple of years now, and so sometimes they can get logged into the wrong version. So just wanna make sure that it does say Cougs Give and it has the right 2019 date. Also, we have a direct link 
to the Cougar Ambassador Toolkit that we've developed this year, and I'll walk you through that toolkit in the next section of the training. Also, exactly like I mentioned before on a previous slide, you're going to be able to click this button and send out CoogsGive emails on your own. Same thing for Facebook, Twitter, and LinkedIn. You'll be able to click those buttons, log in, and create your own unique post that'll be sent out uh, onto those platforms. You'll also be able to see how much you've inspired the donors and the dollars, the people that are making gifts on April 10th because they've clicked on your links that you've provided already in your emails and all of the places I just mentioned. They'll be able to click that, go to Coog's Give. If they make their gift, that will show up right there on your dashboard. Pretty cool. And you'll also be able to track the clicks. So if somebody sees your Facebook post, they click on it, you'll be able to see that they clicked on your post and made their way to coogsgive.wsu.edu. And a really great way to send people to coogsgive.wsu.edu is using these referral links. And the first thing I want to mention on this part is you can actually choose the page that somebody goes to. So for example, if you're a WSU Tri-Cities graduate and you want to give to a fund that's featured on the WSU Tri-Cities page and you want to inspire other people to give to that fund as well, click the drop down menu and you'll actually be able to select people uh, to go directly to that page when they click on your link. Again, a pretty cool feature for the dashboard. Also, this year they have shortened links. So instead of sending this long link to people, you can actually create your own. So mine is backslash Shelly N, and that you can use this in different ways. If you wanna send this in a text message, if you wanna shorten the link down to send in an email, if you're trying to explain to somebody over the phone where they can go, you can actually give them this link. And it's a lot more simple than sending out a really, really long link that somebody might get confused with. And to go back a little bit to the social sharing, I just wanted to visually show you what that would look like. So you're going to click on the Facebook button. If you haven't logged in with Facebook already, they'll ask you to log in and you'll be able to share a unique post with your own message directly to Facebook. And again, when everyone clicks on that Coogs Give large logo, they will be sent directly to coogsgive.wsu.edu. That will should populate on your dashboard if they click it. And then if they make a gift, it should tell you that somebody has made a gift because of your sharing. Again, just a really awesome opportunity to actually see your inspiration at work. So quickly, I wanted to also show you how to make a gift because that part of the platform isn't live yet. Our website will actually be able to start accepting gifts um, on April 10th. So until then, I wanted to show you visually what that might look like. There's going to be a large Give Now button that will populate on the front screen and actually will be on every single giving page, every page that has a fund or a designation that you can give to. And when you hit the Donate page uh, or the Give Now button, it'll take you to the Donate page where you'll be able to select the fund that you'd like to give to, the amount that you'd like to give, and also you can make multiple gifts at once or you can make multiple gifts throughout the day. It's really up to you and your experience. And to finalize your giving, you're going to provide your contact information. Let us know how you want to be recognized on the Coogs Give platform and then complete your gift with a credit card. Very simple and a very easy way to make an impact on Coop's Give. Now this is the cool part. If you are one of those ambassadors that are inspiring the most giving that day, we'll actually have a leaderboard that will have your name on it. And it'll show the top five ambassadors and you can continue to click down um, where it says show five more below all of the names and it'll show more uh, inspirational ambassadors, but really we want to just inspire that friendly competition uh, and see who is really going to be the top ambassador for Coogs Give. 
I do want to make a note that you need to make sure you have a name in your profile for uh, this leaderboard because if you don't, it'll just say Cougar Ambassador. So if you go to your profile, which is in the dashboard, it's on the left-hand side, it'll say profile. Click that and if you do not have a name, make sure you're putting your name in there uh, because that's the only way you'll be able to appear on the Ambassador leaderboard. And this year we've developed a Cougs Give Cougar Ambassador Toolkit. We're really excited to show you this feature this year because it's gonna be your one-stop shop for everything you might need, especially for social media. So first of all, we have a few important links. It's gonna take you back to the Cougs Give homepage where you can make your gift on April 10th. And then we'll also have all of the main WSU Foundation, Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram pages that we'll be working through. Although many different colleges, departments, and campuses are gonna be posting on this day. We will also have profile pictures, Facebook cover photos, uh, Twitter cover photos, and also videos. We'll post a lot of stuff on here leading up to the day. So this may ebb and flow and change as we get more content created. Um, but to start off, you will be able to go ahead and already use these profile images and cover images. We've also created some sample social media posts to get the ball rolling on how you can really uh, communicate what you want through social media on this day or before this day. And definitely think about how you can utilize this in a text message or a phone call. Let's say you want to text somebody the link to the WSU Tri-Cities page because that's where you're giving. You can always start with one of these social media posts when you think about how you can frame that text message. For example, you can use one of these samples and say, I'm making a gift today to WSU Tri-Cities during Cougs Give because I loved my student experience at that campus. Where will you give today? And then insert your own personalized link from the dashboard. Super easy. And the last thing that we've created this year is a really simple document that outlines what it means to be a Cougar Ambassador and the impact that people can really make. So we hope that you can take this, download the PDF, send it out to your friends and your fellow Cougs, and just show them how simple it can be to sign up, make a gift, and really impact student success. And the last thing I wanna leave you with is really that the power is yours. The impact you wanna make, the way you wanna be involved, the inspiration that you wanna create is really up to you. And if the Captain Planet 90s cartoon reference is a little out of date, we also just wanna remind you that kooks are better together. And that's why we love giving days. Kooks are their own superheroes. And when we come together, we are so much more impactful than we are apart. So just remember that as you're continuing to talk to your fellow Cougs about why they should get involved with Cougs Give. And of course, we cannot forget about our own superhero, Butch T. Cougar, and how much he inspires us to have a lot more Coug spirit. Thank you again for attending this training. I really appreciate you taking your time to walk through the webinar and learn about Cougs Give and how to be an impactful Cougar Ambassador. If you have any questions, you can contact us at annual.giving at wsu.edu and go Cougs.